What you're going to hear about today is nothing short of a miracle. It's dramatically new. As we all know, vinyl is warmer than any other kind of sound recording. Anyone that buys records will know this, you know, the feeling of like, you know, you get the record in the post or you get it from the record shop and you you get that record home and you put it on, you know, it's it's a, it's a special feeling. It's like buying a pair of trainers, you know, you, you buy a bad boy pair of trainers and you get them home and you're like, right, these are sick. Café Artem is to be a vibrant creative hub based in the heart of the city centre in one of its most beautiful buildings. It's to be set up to support Birmingham's flourishing creative community drawing people in from all walks of life for a much needed escape from the humdrum world and hustle and bustle of the city. We want to bring back the enjoyment of finding new music and reignite the relationship people have with their records and with music in general. The introduction of somewhere new in Birmingham is, is really needed um, and I think it's going to go down really well with the, the current climate of people buying records and being interested in records um, and not just the general stuff, you know, I think people are, are up for digging deep um, and hopefully that will reflect in the scene as well. The record store is one of the most important uh, aspects of pushing the sound and pushing the culture and I think if uh, we get another really great record store in Birmingham it will become a, a community hotspot you know and a, a cultural hub that will create so much uh, so much great things and offer so much to Birmingham I think it's really important. We believe that there is an intrinsic link between art and music. I think Birmingham is undergoing a, a, a golden time right now as far as as far as the artistic community is concerned and, and as a result Birmingham is feeling more vital artistically than it has in a long, long time. Birmingham shouldn't really compare itself to anywhere else, you know, like London, Manchester, Leeds, anywhere like that, because at the end of the day Birmingham's grateful. Birmingham, Birmingham um, has such a great diversity here, different cultures, you know, religions, colours, smells, there's everything when you're walking around, you really get a sense of, you know, this multicultural society. I think art as a platform is music, painting, photography, sculpture, furniture, fashion, design. I think having all of that in one space, I think would be really good for the city and it would actually encourage other people to do the same kind of thing. There's a resurgence and there's a rebirth in Birmingham and it, if it gets the right support, I think great things will happen. If you've got a place that I can go sit down with three or four of the promoters, we're all communicating and that's how ideas develop. And I think creating that hub where, you know, where you're not obliged to go and create something with someone but you can do your own thing and then get involved in a conversation, I think, I think it's really important. And as I said, I think it's, uh, I think it's the right time for something like that. We really feel that there's a void in Birmingham that needs to be filled. We want Café Artem to give people the opportunity to go and listen to new and old music from around the world on vinyl, as well as have the opportunity to buy artwork from local artists, as well as those who've established themselves internationally, whilst at the same time enjoy a really good cup of artisan coffee. Caffeine's a drug, and records are a drug. You know what I mean? It's simple as that. Simple as that.